Hello guys, and uh, welcome back to another episode of the Train Fever. That's bad news for you. I had some technical issues, and uh, it's hopefully sorted them out. Lost 5 footage. 1975 now, we didn't see last 5 years, so uh, roughly one hour of playtime. I recorded that all of them was strictly economy, uh, to be honest. Uh, I did find out we have to lose money big time, uh, so I had to go and fix everything. Uh, so what did I do? Oh, well, I think that was. I had to cancel the, 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 the fast truck completely. I realized that it's worth the You know, potential to split. There are the people between two lines in the same direction. But now, it's, as you see, it's, really, it's kind of important to look at this one. We obviously need the uh, fastest one. It's making one of the right now. It's gonna really make more. And one of the not doing too bad either. I mean, 270 is really, really low for uh, running. Uh, other roads, I start to replace the old trucks. I've got some of those 18 wheelers now. Uh, to go on. Those are beautiful motions. Uh, this is pretty much. <laughs> uh, carriage. You can carry 18. So if you remember the first trains, it was doing 45 an hour, or 40 was it? This was in the 90. It's much faster, and three carriages will be basically 21. So, this is almost three carriages worth in a train. <laughs> Fast, yeah. Uh, beautiful. And then, when I realized the problem, uh, obviously, I stopped. So, we lost at five years, 1975, as I mentioned. Uh, meaning, I didn't finish the other ones. I'll have to go and fix that as well. But in the meantime, I do remember uh, the, I noticed only one uh, new train came out, new engine. And I realized that engine is so cheap, it like makes no sense to buy anything else or operate anything else. Uh, I'll show you. It was one of the multiple units, it was this one. It came in 1974, there we go. Running costs 350,000. And it can still do 180 km an hour, 84 passengers. So the ones we operate in now are those. Uh, granted, 201 km an hour, power is probably bigger as well, 3.5, actually it's not, forget that, traction 224 and this one is a bit more, so better, probably better acceleration as well, but uh, running cost is 930,000, this one is uh, one third, passengers exactly the same, so I'm gonna sell those, there's no point using those, and I can replace Zephyr which is also more expensive, and it's slower, with much less power, and traction effort with only 52 and we need to replace those first and then we're gonna come back to the uh, to the cars so this one is right now in there meaning the other one is probably oh no this one's coming back now yeah it didn't come exactly exactly like before Four times, but we're gonna follow this one to the depot I do believe uh, I sort of the auto function problems like we are strictly now in a as you see all the years I was fixing in 1932 I got us into plus and that ever since just uh, really getting more and more profit. So we already have some savings of 5.57 million. So these are numbers. Uh, if you want something to buy, we certainly can. I'm definitely going to be looking at the speed in ones. And uh, possibly actually going to replace this effort on the Norton uh, for the fast one as well. If you want, you're just going to still 180 km an hour with this acceleration, 80. And it's only one fourth of that one. Ah, uh, I can, yeah. Well, it's just not Orexon again, because otherwise it can go still bad. It was very, very impressive speed as well right now on 170. that train get out or anything like that I uh, just see it coming up and then I was thinking let's replace it that's my not it's not actually recording at all and, well it's one of these things something happened in the program and uh, location for the recording has changed completely but um, uh, there's no space in there so we can pull the code which is done most of my footage essentially is this one is not 4K now because I can't play this game. It's 4K which is bug out. But it's still 2K so. If you're not that far apart, I'll notice like two hours of those footage, let's say like on average. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna, uh, 
episode. That's roughly 45 gigs of data anyway, so I don't know, 45 gigs of data on that hard drive that it was accidentally turned into. It must have been updated or something and then on its only just salt. Let's get you into depot. Well, they've been good while they lasted, they did, certainly did the job, uh, excellent machine, but we have something much cheaper. Although slightly slower, uh, but not worry too much about that. This one, for instance, was only 60 out of 81, so maybe we're gonna have now exactly 80 in the other ones. I should probably stop this now. Let's sell. Let's get the new one. I use the multiple guns and let's. It's very weird uh, in design. Uh, 1974. And let's put you on the. Please put the gems in there. Let's get him out. But extremely cheap. Like, this is like a game changer. Actually, look at the design. Must have looked very futuristic in 1974 as well, but uh, kind of happy. It's sort of looking ugly to me. Reminds me of one of the dinosaurs uh, from profile like this. Uh, I wouldn't be able to tell you which one, but pretty much with the head like this. Uh, no offense. <laughs> it's not ugly, ugly, but it, no, I, I just don't like it uh, that much. Uh, and I do like trains. Uh, I like this one as well, to be honest. End of the day, I do like it. But it's kind of so let's watch the acceleration. It's actually very decent. It's probably faster than the one before, which was doing 201 as a top speed. Uh, this may not be as fast, but the acceleration is there on this event. I was thinking, why is this one down now? Oh, yeah. oh what is that? That's a new passenger carriage, I believe. You know, I wonder, since we are not operating more than two trains, there will be always one but up and down. I don't even need those anymore, I can literally just do separate uh, track in there to make it faster so it doesn't have to slow down. Uh, that's one of the things I was really observing when I was trying to fix the economy as well. There's many sections in the loops north and south. Uh, literally. Those tiny bands are great potential energy because you have to slow down way ahead just to fit to appropriate speed for the band. So thus, kind of negating some of the nice and long straights because let's say, let's say this company is straight and we still have massive speed at all. Let's say 200 meters ahead is like very sharp band. So the train has to slow down as quickly as it goes out. It will start breaking here. The train is very heavy. Maybe it's even 80, we'll start slowing down now, now, now very slowly, gently. It's one rough ride. Until it reaches 30 km an hour, it the band So it doesn't even really do that fast because it doesn't really do that. now 79. And the maximum was 8, so it's pretty much like going now. So I forget how much the other one. Where is it actually the other one? I must have missed it. I just approached it, yeah. What we want to do, we're going to solve this one too. So I'm not going to find out what was the actual speed on this one anymore. I have to watch it. I'm sure. Let's record it. Uh, but to me, it didn't even reach 2-1. To me, it wasn't possible. So that 180 is actually more than decent. And it's 3,000 cheap. Three times. That's cheap. So obviously, we're going to solve this one too. And let's put the appropriate replacement for it. Uh, then we'll have to also go on to the Zephyrs, or the North Loop and replace that one. It is less powerful, essentially it's uh, slower actually as well. It's more expensive too, although it looks much better. But that was 1934, I mean how many years? That's 74, 40 years later. Something which is better option than Zephyr. Uh, let's actually slow this down completely. Um, let's put you on there. Alright, cool. Uh, I am, I am completely plating. Uh, perhaps I should put... Even on the... Uh, now that we making money. 
probably should put on the Nortrub as well, one of the speed ones. Now it's down to 400k now, I'm sure it's because of the maintenance cost. Uh, we may have some people on it, let's see. 38, it's gonna make some money again. But it's very, very expensive. This one to run is 1.3 million, so we can make it by 1 million cheaper in operation. And it's still decent. I mean, this is a maximum speed was 2.10, isn't it? Yes, it was 2.10. So 30 kilometers less with about the same acceleration but it will cost only one fourth in how much the train costs and in yearly cost as well. I mean economically yeah when we'll we're looking at it. Why are you doing exactly seven kilometers now my friend? Oh it's just leaving the Station and this is the very one after Pittsburgh and I think I recognize it. So got a long drive following this and we're gonna have to Yeah, Pittsburgh then uh, Oh never mind there's one more anyway. The second one but we still get the full loop essentially to go around until the depot. Uh, hopefully I will catch it in time. But in the meantime we can look at the other stuff. This wood is doing probably fine. The train is just leaving yet. Yeah. I want to deliver. Because I needed to change the track. This is the very old ones as well. Um, they have been on automatic replacement and they bought the old one. So it's probably not a good thing. I probably shouldn't use that. Uh, this one is with the only one. And this is something else anyway. Different car. It's coming from there. I never mind. Uh, let's check this wood. Just in case is this increase the production. No chance for 25. Oh wait, this is the actual production of the wood, that's the lumber mill, and then we also have oil. I was also thinking at some point when I was trying to uh, save the economy, just buy the cheating, you know, uh, trains and put every production everywhere. Like I know those open right now, but I put train on there, which basically cost me hundred dollars to buy and 30,000 a year to, to run, so it's really nothing. And I'm, I believe maybe if even 3 years you can make uh, you know profit, because it will make the 20,000 by maybe delivering just one mugger. But, uh, so that's a kind of guarantee of money, uh, that cheating train, we can, we can abuse the system like that if, if necessary, but right now it's not, we, we're making money. So I'm not going to bother with that at all, really. Now we're doing some decent speed. But again, the application is normally there in comparison to the one we just bought. That's going to be probably fine right now, once in a time. It is probably as good as the Shinkansen, really. But Shinkansen can uh, go all the way to 210. Although it can do, uh, as it definitely on the loops, it's moving 209. But it will do 209, so it's still almost 30 more than 180. Decent, if you ask me. But it's just beautiful, it's definitely so beautiful train. Uh, so let's some focus yeah rail lords are right now everything's like in plus it says uh, roads they are making money too but those old ones I wanna replace them so and that's coming from the where exactly is it again? Why is this one that's coming from the wood yeah and then we get two goods going, one is going to the, that city and one is going down there. Gotcha. Well, uh, again, that's probably, we can replace all the cars with just one 18 wheeler in each direction and that, that'll, that'll be it. And three and uh, four. Don't, don't bother with that at all. Probably not even. I'll, I'll just sell all of them right now. No questions asked. Simply updated now. The speed on this one was only 40 km so the 8 wheel is uh, like quite and a half fast, uh, times as fast, and uh, it's taking 18 out of it's twice as much storage as well. Uh, so let's buy those. Right. We need goods. Two of them 
One is going on line 10. One is going on line 9. I'm oh, sure that's still going to make money. How to upgrade some country roads as well for the other 18 wheelers. Uh, that's something I was doing as well because those roads they don't support 90 km an hour. So we can upgrade them. Which one is the street one? Small country road, this one. Just the basic, basic. Yeah, so we can do the 90 there. Now, all the way to this one is. Well, the last bit is not. Can we. No, it will not let me. It's already street, I guess. Ah, oh, I'm getting bothered. That last bit is not that important, and all of this is. Where is that? Is it going all the way here? No way, that's a. Where is he going? Those are the depots, right. Where is the... Where do we unload the goods? It must have been somewhere there. I know what was going there, what was going there. I think it was somewhere here. I don't see anything yet. Uh, oh, he's right here. Okay, never mind. Yeah, but... On the streets, he's probably 60 anyway on here. Oh, who cares? Uh, it's still more than the other cars can do, they can call, call down only 40 km an hour, so now the 18 wheeler is going to be doing still 60 in there, regardless and on those normal roads, 90. Uh, this one is empty, this one's got 6. Well, either way, it's fine. Where is the train? Oh, this is almost unloaded. It's coming back and uh, yeah, there is some... I've been improving, yeah, there's 60 some now. Interesting. The uh, question is, when it comes here, is it going to be instantly full or not? 14. What's your Kelly's rule? 21. Oh, never mind. Will definitely not be 21. Let's uh, turn on the cargo to see how quickly. Oh, right, that's rather quick. And by one, add enough. 15. I'll be 16. That's 17. Only 4 more, and it's going to go. Interesting. Uh, let's have a look at those. How does it look on the main one? Salt and uh, Salt Loop Fast is still there. Normal one is only 4 people. Normal Loop is 28 and Peace Book 2 is 22. I assume both trains are in mid, yeah, mid section, so that's going to be more people there. This one was not 28. In comparison to yeah, this one's gonna oh, 25. Sorry, where is up here? I totally forget about that train. Is it passed again on the next loop, or is it still going there? Well, let's try to find it. Uh, up here, where are you? Oh no, not even close. Yeah, it's still. Or is it next loop already? Wait, 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 wait. No, it's not. Yeah, this is still the first loop. Let's go in here and then uh, this port gives it. Right here, yes. Oh my god. No, probably most of done one loop. Why would be only, only here? I also watch it better. I think most have done one loop already. But that seems to be too fast. It's like. All the way around one way. In the meantime, I wasn't that full, was I? It seems to be like full, but it's not full, it's just those two tracks. And it was going quite fast enough. Soon enough, this one's gonna be full and going. There's already new loads. I mean, how much are we producing on this? 60 fucking 8. It's pretty much the same, it's probably matching the production. We need extra wheelers on the, that one. And uh, I suppose that, yeah, I want to do that. So that's again, that's going to increase. 
those are goods, yeah, all of that is goods. So let's buy goods, buy, buy. Uh, let's keep the zipper in the, in the window actually, in there. And now I do believe the nine line now is going to be soon leaving, so let's position that one there. I'm not sure even 10 can be already waiting. They're still spending money even in depot. Believe or not, I'm not sure if it lies or not, but as soon as you buy them, they start eating away maintenance. The question is, this is going to block now. Number 10, it, it does. They're so long, they, they can't even pass through there anymore. So this literally has to be gone for that one to be able to take place in here. Oh, that's going to happen now. What a beautiful sight. Those beautiful machines. This one's gonna be. Oh, that's still on the cylinder. This one is not a, that popular. I'm going to that side. Perhaps this was our extension. Let's get rid of that until we, it's confirmed that that line is actually popular too. So we're gonna be going left, I believe. Let's have a little bit of acceleration as well. That's pretty decent, well it's already fast, way faster than the other ones. It could be only 40. And my question is when it's gonna reach the streets, how fast it can go, it's slowing down. So that's 50, but it's still doing 10 kilometers more than the ones before. So suddenly, yeah, I'm gonna use a 90 anywhere near, but on this one, it's something world. If uh, that line 10 is gonna be actually in operation at all, something's going that side too. I don't have many, let's sell this one in the meantime. So sell it for the same price as we bought it. Is it good, my friend? How does it look? Oh, it looks like we're closing, but it's still kind of far away. And the acceleration the fruit is from there. Well, it's gonna impale a lot when uh, we replace with the other one. It's gonna impress speed when it's built up. I think even this section is gonna build up up to 160 or something like that. As a matter of fact, there's nothing else to do now. Let's just get this section out of the tunnel. I don't know. Let's see it. Let's. I'm sure, we've seen it built up anyway. I'll just uh, focus on the numbers. Okay, so doing 100 now. It should probably start accelerating much faster. As it used to be. Let's see how much it's actually going to do on this section. Before slowing down again. Oh, 20 is already decent. Okay, I'm sure we'll be stationed soon. Let's speed up though. Okay, it's slowing down now, so it's going to be fine. Some people waiting here. Some people were on board. How do we do? Actually, mine is right now. Well, last year it was half a million in plus. I mean, yeah, it's still it's good. We want to upgrade this line from now. We can build more confidence with uh, putting a more performance, performance wise, uh, better train. We just block our own uh, eating wheeler. So this machine was less than 100 an hour, so it's going down instead of dying. Well, there seems to be again a lot of people there making some money. And look, it's still 98 something behind. Where's the depot? There's still one more station. I believe the other one is going to really always reach the 180 between those stations. It's much faster than that here. It has... Uh, this one is... Port 
448 kilowatts power, that one is 3600. So, well, let's say it's 8 times 4 of those. But uh, traction, this one was like uh, 208, I think, kilowatt newtons, and the other one is like. God damn it. I missed it. I'm a fucking idiot. I'm a fucking idiot. And uh, now you need to need a hold again. <laughs> okay, new train. I'm gonna certainly have a look at it. Well, so a few of my friends are gonna leave for one more round. Let's have a look at this one. Last year, minus in thousands. Uh, yes. So that that should be new year now. Why is it like that? That's not pretty slightly in plus. And those are now doing eight millions. Huh. You will make more money and for cheaper. Uh, this is uh, maybe it's balancing how much you actually make in the end after the maintenance goes deducted. I'm, I'm not even sure, but I think this is pure income. Uh, it doesn't count the deduction, and now it's falling down into six million for some reason. Oh, because it's taking out the oh, it's, it's balancing then. It is balancing. It's taking out the maintenance, and that's the pure profit it made. Of course, you're you know, doing the maintenance because it's right here. That's why we see the minus numbers in there. So yeah, that should be that's actually ma uh, after maintenance. Yeah, that's the pure profit how much you're making. Interesting. How do you trump all of them? Yeah, well, except Pittsburgh. But the roads, yeah, those are now making more money than before as well. Good to see. This line ten. Leaving left, uh, it's probably still the same one there. Uh, it looks like this one is still managing to come. As it increases, it increases 69 now. Yeah, we may need to adjust that soon enough. I uh, need to see though, I'm just gonna be coming so look this way. Let's click on the depot, and I think this is a separate engine, which it is. This one came in 1978, uh, it's doing 2 and 1 as well kilometers with uh, quite very good power, 4320 uh, tractor effort is not that impressive and it costs 1.26 million a year not something we're going to be looking at really but it lasts, it, lifespan is supposed to be 55 years, that's absolutely insane all these actually they're doing here, this one was 50 as well that begs the question how much is this one? 35 years how much is Shinkansen? 45, okay. It's also something to consider. But we don't really have uh, a purpose for this one. Yeah, there's no purpose for that one. Get better options. In all honesty. Uh, where are you, my friend? Still far away. Yeah. Oh, something new. Uh, that looks like a tram. So you can start uh, start replacing those, I guess. For new ones. And the fast one coming. Shinkansen. I love it now, change the engine. One of my favorite moments. And I hope I'm gonna have like all chucks full of chains and passing by and merging and stuff. Well, we can speed up again. Since I got 23 minutes, I should maybe start finishing the extension for the fast loops and stuff. Uh, I can spend some money there. At least finish, in, finish the one that I started and uh, I didn't connect in the end. Probably 10 minutes uh, left to, to connect that, but that will be a massive extension as well. And 
perhaps we can put something in the fast food after as well. I'm told there is a lot of people really. I shouldn't separate it into fast and slow. Because that's taking away uh, potential customers. Uh, they should be relying only one one line and all going there. So to guarantee that chain is making money. Uh, definitely over extension, over, over reach really. And uh, was possible economically for no reason, just because I wanted to like already have set up like two trains in the slow ones and one on the fast one and no one will make any money then so it's easy way I finish the connection I mean, I had any more money to finish it and we got in financial troubles and I just tried to connect it to the city well, once we sell this one and put the new one on the loop and then we're gonna watch the new one as well on, on the loop to perform we kind of know what this one is doing uh, And back in the day it was very impressive performance but now it's definitely lacking behind. Uh, the biggest thing that I was going for it was the maintenance was like still half or even a third of what was the other other trains, so it was uh, impressive, but now we can have something even cheaper. By half the price of this one pretty much almost. And better in performance, so yeah it won't not make any sense to keep Zephyrs around anymore. But uh, it was them who saved the economy as well, at some point. And it was the workhorse who could make money. Uh, with very decent performance. Uh, while looking sexy. So, no complaints really. I, I'm gonna be sad to see in this one, as the last one in operation we have. But, uh, such is life at some point. I mean, in the future, when we got like tons and tons of money, everything set up, we're probably gonna set up a uh, like Zephyr to attraction. Well, out of nostalgia, we can, we can make it happen. Uh, we'd love to operate those. Uh, but right now, we need to think, think still about the money. I mean, 37 million may seem to be a lot of money in comparison to what we have before. But as soon as I start construct, uh, 28 million will not get me that far. We'll probably even finish the whole extension of the, of the fast track uh, for the Sultan, uh, for getting the Nordmark, that's going to be like 100 million investment as well. Uh, so yeah, it's not actually that much money. And then we're going to be starting again, put into test some new machines, uh, maybe expensive in running, but they will have impressive performance and we're going to try to replace, or maybe put this on the separate fast track rules, uh, I shouldn't do that ever, it's just to replace the old one. Uh, I'll see, so, but maybe we're gonna operate again, let's try to split it in half and, and see what happens uh, maybe it's gonna be not dragging us down so In the end I do wanna have two trucks for sure uh, I don't necessarily need to make money on the north or south moves or fast one or small one, it doesn't really matter to me as long as the other stuff can uh, compensate for running those and those will be slowly but surely because of operation uh, they'll be incre increasing in how much money they earn it but I cannot afford like before to be 4 years uh, in a row or 5 years, it was maybe even more. 4-5 uh, years uh, essentially in deficit. Oh shit 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 stop. <laughs> we need to go. Some people I forgot, I don't mind, we can lose some people. We need to go in the depot, I almost made another run. In the loop. can't afford another 5 years of uh, deficit uh, running essentially fast track along with the Solmos and then uh, none of the chains will be money too much uh, because of the high maintenance of some of the units which we use uh, the Steelers Farms and Chains like the Shinkansen as well at some point but that we, before that we used different ones uh, it was just too much the Pittsburgh to West Jordan couldn't really compensate for that and uh, everything fell apart so that wasn't optimal and so on you and let's put actually the multiple one, this one. Like those are like 960 less passengers as well, less power. Like this is absolute again. Like it makes no, it makes no sense not to have that one. This one has better traction though, so maybe with slightly smaller power, but it will be accelerating better. But I'm not going to be paying three times as much for uh, maintenance, especially when it doesn't uh, take as many passengers neither. So yeah, let's, let's buy this one of course, uh, let's put it on the north loop. 
Um, let's compare. Let's compare it because now this train has we know between Pittsburgh and West Jordan can reach that uh, maximum speed 180. I do wonder uh, what is the distance we can achieve now. So maybe how many sections are going to be running on 180? Maybe it's going to be more sections than the Shinkansen, but I doubt. I mean, Shinkansen has the power. It's probably as heavy as this one, but it's uh, let's see. Oh, we can check it out right now. Shinkansen. 210 km an hour, we know that uh, it's heavy 330 tons. This one is 160 tons, okay, it's half a, half a ton, uh, half a of weight. But Polo on Shikasen is 4400, but to be fair, 3600 for half of weight is not bad. But Shikasen has 720 km of traction, while this one has only one fourth, 224. It's tough call, it's still half a weight, but in theory, it's still only 400. Traction definitely 700. Oh, but this one has much more power, but there's no traction. Uh, I don't know, Shikasen is probably still faster in acceleration. Not something to be tested. <laughs> well, only if we put it next to each other and, and run them, we'll be seeing which one is really performing better in underworld condition. This may have more power into the heels, but then again, it doesn't have traction, so probably not. Probably not. It's really something to be tested and that's the only way how to really say which one will be absolutely faster. All we know for sure is that uh, this one will never reach more than 180. While we do know that Shinkansen is showing up to 109 for at least twice on the loop, for quite a long time as well, in two different sections. Uh, that much we know, so... Hey, you know what? When I look at it, actually, the less I mine it, uh, it's actually not that ugly. I think from profile is the ugliest, but then, then I see it like, like this. I don't mind it actually, I kind of like it a lot. I wish it was, wasn't sticking out too much in a, like, to the top, at the top, it was more like streamlined, like a jet. That would be a really cool look then. And this station looks fully packed. Yeah, imagine this cockpit uh, will be like streamlined with this one exactly, but it will, it will have this glass in there in the front. So this will be like lower cut, it will be going somewhere here, and the glass will be here, but it will be still the same like that in front. Uh, more like Shinkansen essentially, but with this kind of cockpit, like Formula 1. That would be cool. But I bet the driver had very good view from there, it wasn't feel Amazing when you go to speed as well. Uh, we break the 110 kilometers an hour. Let's get in there to the speed. as the three of at this kind of speed. Very, very good station, but at the higher speed, to be fair. She didn't speed up as, as fast. So, so far, I'm, I'm still not that impressed. It's really not as speed different as I thought. It's going to be exactly. Should have. It's after the traction. It's much more power. Uh, the only question is, I uh, didn't check when we can. How much heavy was this one? This was 105 tons. That's 160, okay, so let's see that's now twice as much. But traction 80 to 224 was... Uh, but this is uh, probably the biggest downfall. Power is only 448 compared to 3600. It should be way, way faster. In actuality.
So this is very cheap to run as well, I assume yeah. instantly we are up to first sale in class, paid for the whole ship to here. Okay, if you're always gonna have some people, oops. We also is gonna have some people which now we only have six. Definitely pay for itself. So it's gonna be funny. Still it's uh, almost really half the price of this there. So even based on that, like even if the person was exactly the same, which this is probably better person to do, must be. Like I just have to listen why the full video we're going to now. This is absolutely crazy now. Really. Faster. It begs the question, uh, when it does the whole loop, I think it's going to calculate the, the time. But right now it says, right now it says this train can do the loop in 17 minutes. While the Shinkansen, although it must be faster, says it's 22. Hmm. And that is very interesting. We knew it was going to be similar in performance, but this shouldn't be 5 minutes apart. I was expecting if this is 22, then this will be 23. And also 17. Uh, and if it's going to be faster, I'll get to 21. An average, but... That seems to be off. I mean, this didn't do in a single yet, so maybe that's going to change. After we actually finalize this, maybe prediction. But who knows? Maybe the node loop is uh, faster on its own, like in this direction going than the other way. So although this is more powerful train, south loop is still by definition slower. That can be only tested by putting Shinkansen on this node loop and see what it's going to say there. Which I am going to do. And that means I'll have to solve this one and then put Shinkansen there. Maybe later when we, we're going to only be playing and testing stuff if we get to that stage. Not like this. At some point, you'll really make so much money and so quick. All that we make is to test out all the engines left and uh, create any track on the that are uh, created. Some of them can be really just a straight line, uh, which is a performance test. But even making money it doesn't matter. It's literally a straight line across the map. And then uh, putting trains in there and testing them how fast I can do it. Mutual race, maybe we put like eight tracks next to each other, a straight line across the uh, map, and then buy different, eight different trains, run them, and then see, you know, like drag race essentially, drag race with the, the trains. I would love to see that. Uh, just, <laughs> I know now I'm already, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> I will. Oh yeah, the thought will actually maybe longer because of all this extra. I have to do like this definitely on the this way, but on the inner circle, not the outer circle. It's possible, yeah, the soul will much longer than that. If you know, this can be south, it's like outer circle, and not the inner circle. So that will also explain why it is uh, faster, although it should be slower. I think we already make like maximum speed, but again, that's really good. We never did more than 158 hours. 176? No, 168. Most of this one was not very possible, but we never did that for 168. We did that for a little bit. This is already running 80 and it didn't work. I mean, the other record was done on this salt. Maybe it was another one, but we just didn't watch it. I always tested it for some reason myself because we run always trains in there, you know, this kind of sideline. Uh, same reason why this one is now the last train to upgrade and put there because it leaves to always kind of on the sidelines uh, so far. We saw loophole simply uh, not on purpose, but it just simply happened. It was the one that we was uh, really trying to optimize first and we started doing the extension on there as well for the last track first. So we kind of know what it was possible there. I don't really know that we did on this side. It may have been recorded. Uh, I may have done a full rain on trip on the north of here. And those are speeds recorded, but I don't really know anymore from my head now. So I won't know, but one thing for sure, we can never do 180, because uh, the limit of there was 177. 
is just impressive. If this is 180 and Zephyr is 177 and there is 40 years between them, that speaks volumes. Oh, Zephyr was a really amazing turn. We're gonna see it again, so I'm sure. Oh my god, the deck position really on, on the bottom, like, separate group will be like 30 right now, 40 max. This is already 80 now. And it's only getting better as the game speeds. But it's, it's electric, I mean, we need to expect that the Axe is much faster. And it means that same loving cars, and the energy is simply there instantly. There's no combustion, no pressure like that, it's simply just energy going straight into the motor, and that's going to be instantly. So it will be actually much faster. Okay, so I see. So full speed, I don't know how it works with the LCD. I assume it takes um, really immense power to create uh, top speed, so it's much harder to you know, make electric things, even cars like that, to make it go very, very fast. It will accelerate fast, but to create a top speed which is breaking like through the wind essentially so you need like I don't know as an example I, I can I don't know this for sure but you know my uh, peasant brain tells me it's probably same like with the cars when it comes to the, to the diesel and so let's say we get we need to do 400 uh, kilowatts or we need 400 kilowatts uh, power to I'm, I'm pulling this out of my ass yeah, it's the only example let's say we need 400 kilowatts to to do to reach 100 kilometers an hour in speed, but you will need 2,000 to do 150. You see what I mean? Like you need 5,000 watts just to make another 50 kilometers an hour, and then when you want to do like 400, uh, oh my god, I believe like you need 10 megawatts or something like that. It's like ludicrous, like just to make 10 or 20 extra kilometers an hour, but the pressure of the wind will be against you will be much faster, like much more friction essentially and you'll need like okay now we need two times as much power just to make an extra 20 kilometers an hour so and with the budget because the technology is not really there as you know it's a real problem all the chance they have the cable so that really, it's not a problem in with uh, running out of the juice but it's certainly a problem how much juice can go into the train although I don't know the hard water should be fine uh, I don't really know how this it can work and certainly know how it works in cars and that's the main problem in there the size of the battery uh, it literally have to be so big you can't re really reach the speeds that diesel can do right now but uh, supposedly it can it will change with the Tesla Roadster it will be similar it's still similar it will be, no actually those uh, rumors it will be faster than a uh, Chiron or Chiron is actually not even this fastest car I, I believe it's only one of the killings it's just not tested properly uh, even Ford uh, it was too long but actually it was a Ford and break, break uh, the first 500 kilometers an hour uh, but it wasn't sure he was just publicized uh, but Ford did it before him uh, about three months before that in America he yeah, was old Ford uh, also like modified so perhaps for that reason as well nobody really care that much like somebody tune a car you know old for GT and uh, okay now it beats 500 kilometers an hour although it was the first car which was street legal as well in history that made 500 kilometers an hour but it was tuned car so nobody cared so surely technically it's also tuned car because it was a special version of that called the sweep tail not actually the one that they're selling the normal one but it was pretty close to that uh, they just made it a bit longer uh, so it got better uh, downforce Otherwise, it may have flew in the air, <laughs> you know. Uh, and it definitely makes it faster as well to reach the highest top speed. Well, because more downforce, of course, as well. Uh, so, yeah. yeah. It was the first car who is kind of like made in factory as, as it came out, out of the line that did it. But technically, it was still modification, so I don't really uh, think personally that uh, Ford shouldn't be considered to be the first car that ever did it because yeah it was modified but so what so so was the technically the Chiron Sweet Tail it was one of the kind uh, perhaps it was made modified in the factory in the company itself and not by some 
enthusiast or, or specialized company, which was different than Ford. But again, it shouldn't even matter. It's still modified. They don't sell sweet tails for customers to buy. And there's still only one in existence. And now, uh, I'm following this chain. I'm the main the Right, but you know what? We should probably start doing something. And perhaps it will be a good time to have a look. Where. Where was the connection? I uh, finished it. Where is it? Oh my god, that's quite far away. It was actually here. And then, did we have to skip this one or not? No, we were skipping this one, so it has to be connected to the next one. Well, let's see, just for the interest. How much will that cost, or it may cost, because there will be some fine tuning need to be done. Can we do it next to the truck without having collisions now? Oh, this is now attached. Oh, 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 oh. come on computer. Leaf. I, I don't think we will be able to connect this. The actual station after. See what it like that is no way. So I'll, I'll much rather somehow connect it to here. So it means I will need to find make a like manually the best possible angle I can. Let's say something it's still 300 yeah? Yeah all of it. Let's say something like this. Three millions I can leave it out. Let's extend that. So that should be now, yeah, fully extended. All across. And now I do believe this will be creating the possibility to, yeah, there we go, to put it next to each other. I'll have to slow down to 2.14.2, but who cares? <laughs> who cares? I'm approaching the station regardless. I actually want to do it. Oh, that's gonna slow down this one, yeah, because actually, no. That is the maximum speed I can... Hmm, it's the angle itself. Can't afford, it has to be closer. Oh, I can try, I guess. This is only 200,000. Yeah, I, I shall try and, and see if it's possible. To still connect it or not. Which I assume, yeah, definitely not. But if we extend a little bit more, we more extreme angle, no way. I'm gonna have to play with this. Let's try to go about it from the other way around. Uh, how soon can we leave? We cannot. This is literally too long. Okay, so we have to destroy that. Uh, let's pause the game just in case change will try to pass by. Uh, this is perhaps too long anyway, for no reason. And the other that, that, that I was really trying to maintain as high speed as I could on there. Now, I didn't think about it, uh, that I will perhaps need another connection from there. Uh, extra one. So I should probably make those as short as possible to allow for that to happen. Which is too high, so you can connect it here. It's still better than before, so it may work, we'll see. Well, this side actually is the one I need to make work, and now it's giving me a headache. It's funny when we initially had this before connected, and then it just says no, you can't. Well, there's only one way we can do it. Destroy that part. And then I need to remember to put the lights back. The signals, I mean. Okay, there we go. And it can connect much sooner, though. I'll try to equalize the lights on the same side, like there. I do believe you can still extend this. And then connect it regardless. No, we can't. Okay, how about... I'll try to do it from there. Oh, 
Yeah, this will be okay. So this may be set up mistake again. I can connect it sooner. I'll shell. Again, it won't be symmetrical. So you, in the future, we'll be able to do that. Wait, why is it not working again? God damn it. In the future, when we want to do the same thing for the north, obviously, I'll we'll have to rebuild that side again from scratch. Uh, 49 only, but it's still leaving the station or from some of this country coming, so you will have to slow down significantly. No more loop. This one will be coming out. At least if it's possible, though. It's somewhat possible. Okay, maybe extend a little bit. Let's see. Come on, don't tell me. Okay, this is possible. Um, now I just need to... Uh, it's not going to be pretty, but... Uh, it's going to be slow as well as fuck. But it is what it is. How much do I need to delete? God damn it. To be honest, I don't see a better way how to do that. And then simply take it from there and connect it to here. And whatever angle allowed. I was going 300, 300. How is this possible? Why is this still showing 300? It makes no sense as if it's not connected. What it says it is. Oh, that's really weird. Oh, I'm gonna be mad about it. That's supposed to be like all the way fastest possible speed on those kind of trucks up to 300 but this must be really slowing then like it must be slowing down for that uh, it's gonna be coming from this side so let's put the light in there and we must have deleted this light to the south those two are there fine uh, one way yes okay so this part of extension is or the bypass I should say for the south path done and then uh, supposedly from this station we are skipping the next town which is this one so I want to again just make one straight line straight to the next station which will be down there that's gonna be even more expensive isn't it well I suppose again this is a even to find like where, where exactly can be separated one track extra it won't be possible anywhere like this is already as close as it can same on here we can always build next to it but not on it and obviously this ain't a possibility so I'll have to delete again some portions that's really upsetting Do I even need this kind of? It's too short. What's that gonna gain? Not much across, uh, at least it will just. Yeah, I think this is way too short. As far as I was thinking, you know, if there would be many, many, many trains, then uh, one can be hold in here, the other one can be hold in here, but in reality, we don't have that many trains. And what happens is, every time it needs to switch the truck, it's gonna be slowing in here, then again on there. It doesn't go in a straight line. But if this is like one piece, I think. Yeah, let's start refining the, the trucks and rebuild. Like, this section is definitely overkill. Definitely overkill. There's no need for something like this. Oh, let's stop it. We need to do the flight as well. It will easily be. More straight. Oops. It's a large piece. Cut. Never mind. Hopefully it won't be any issue. This one is this. What was I thinking doing this really? 
it's way too short now this is much better section even if the train has to stop it will okay we'll stop in here and then as soon as the, the other train will pass this section you can go there and to be honest at those speeds yeah this won't take that long to pass anyway so I don't know what I was, what I was thinking no, that was a mistake from the start doing it like that north south Oh, since I was doing this, I probably should have deleted all of this and then put that one extra. Oh, we could have deleted this this part. Oh. Huh, <laughs> This should be the last one then. So if it's gonna be here, it's, no, it's gonna be missing this city and then back to Pittsburgh but uh, Pittsburgh is off limits to how we gonna bypass all of that like oh we can still probably yeah and then connect to somewhere here and probably a bypass still so we got two more to do what's the year? 1982 1982 we still have the same trains. I'm gonna play with some new train. Let's check how our gold mines doing. Ah, definitely people there. How far away is this train? It's bringing 69 from the other one on the side. So, this is money last year 288. The year before the 298 and the year before 415. Let's check how much actually the mines making on average. 681 is not good as before. Something happened. This is losing money now, but uh, as you see, this one's making money. No good. This is really economic for one. It's gonna make money. No matter what, it's gonna make money. It's too cheap to operate not to make money. And with that great performance, uh, people are uh, trusting all the user services. Nice and quick. Maybe it's time. I mean, I was just thinking, yeah, this is really cheap to operate. Even if I split the cells into slow one and fast one, if I put one of those on the slow one, most likely it's gonna make some money, regardless. It really, it's, it's that cheap, and it's not gonna make money, it's not gonna eat us down by a million or something like that. And we already have the Shinkansen, so the Shinkansen is gonna make no money at all, like now. It's gonna make no money at all. It's, you know, it's already pretty much eating as much as you can. Who cares? Uh, let's have a look. Let's look at these finances. Yeah, every year in the last two years, there's uh, more than a million in minus in the actual operation cost. Let's have a look. It's 1.4 million, so it's making like 200,000 on average. It's not that, not that great. But I do believe it's. it's uh, Uh, now we actually know, we can go through. So it used to be 17 minutes, now it shows 21. So, and this one so far, is definitely longer. Not as short as the north, as the outer city. So, that means sections where you have to show a lot more. Okay, it's obviously so pretty, it doesn't mean it takes many, many times while doing the route. So, yeah, the difference in the minute is they not only still faster, supposedly, but uh, it's good that the Shinkan is faster train uh, in the end, because otherwise, uh, if you put on the south loop, uh, one of the north uh, train probably do it like in 24 or 25 minutes not far behind but they really close in first minutes but uh, Shinkansen is still faster and uh, it's only one minute longer because of the actual slope would be longer in, uh, in distance and possibly more difficult terrain uh, it's hard to tell it may be more fun in there than the uh, so I have to follow Either way, uh, yeah, very close in person as you guys. Anyway, 
with how much money we make now, I guess we can definitely afford to lose the one million in there. And even if I add that one chain on the salt instead, it will make more money than minus one million. Or if it goes in minus, it will only go by to minus by four hundred thousand, uh, by another four hundred thousand. But it will be at least uh, something I would, you know, it's like for the fun of it. We have the service there. We get two different looks. We operate it maybe over time. Uh, it will increase, which it will over increase over time, and we can afford to run it regardless. Because uh, well, it says in nineteen eighty one we actually lost money. How's that possible? What happened? Construction cost. I was doing the truck, and that cost millions. Yeah, the truck is down because we only making like three, three millions, oh, five millions, four millions. Let's say now we're going to have five millions in profit. So when I spend five millions in on the trucks, of course we're going to end up in minus. But if there's, a, you know, if if we don't do anything and we losing four hundred thousand, then we're still going to make four and a half million, or even five, possibly, in in profit. So it's it's not that, yeah, it's not going to be like bad. I think we should do that. I think we should do that so we can start playing, but I probably should, before I do that, I probably should finalize the whole salt loop. It must be the bypass from here, isn't it? We just finished this bypass. Uh, uh, no, that's not it. Oh, it was actually to here, yeah, it was it. Now we need to find, we need to shorten up. Shorten this up so I can put separate. We go Shinkansen on the way. We're gonna put you on the fast one, so don't worry. We'll still stop at this station, but the next one you will not bother. Just fly by. Yeah, so we'll have to, we'll have to demolish this. Let's wait for the train to be completely behind the lights as well, so we may delete the tracks, it will not vanish with the train. <laughs> Below the train or something like that. It probably will not let us, uh, that's the biggest problem. So yeah, this will have to go. And the best thing how to go about it is what I always do. Like, uh, okay, so this is obviously the main lines. Uh, we have the one in case you need to overtake. Uh, let's make it much shorter. Uh, this is the north. So when they approach the north, it won't slow down, but not too much. Let's, let's say to 80 kilometers an hour. That's 85 on, on the bend anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Let's make it this long. The same should be possible on this side. Okay, exact matter. There we go. Oh, wasn't that painful? And then that's gonna allow us to do a separate line for the bypass. I wanna make it as fast as possible. We'll have to, we'll have to split I guess we can. So let's say it's 97 there. And then we'll have to yeah. Do we use this drone or no? Yes we do. It's like no. No, we don't. There is no station there. I don't. I don't care about this road. We may as well just go. I don't care. At least anybody who wanted to use a personal car now. Oh, there's nowhere to go though. <laughs> like if you sever a connection between the cities, they will be forced to use the trains. If I was a little bitch, I'll just do that. You know, and force. Uh, I will stop all the traffic essentially that way. First one traffic with the car, so you like you severed all the connections, and then like, they have to use the train now to get to the other city. So you can abuse the game in that way if you wanted to. Let's see, that's actually not bad in price yet. Now, what do we do? Yeah, this is the one we need to bypass. Okay, I see it now. Oh, there's a collision already. Supposedly until then we can do it like normal. And I think that's pretty good to me, then we, it's gonna be sharper bent, I guess.
I think that's uh, that's solid. I don't want to mess with it too much. Let's confirm this. Uh, it's six million. Well, yeah, there we go. It can still maintain 300 in anyway. That's uh, exactly what we wanted. We we'll need to connect it somehow on this side. Oh, I think that's connected now. That's insane. It's much easier than I thought. It's gonna be oh, the two million fell, but at least we got it. And this is one of the things again. Why did I do this? This could be just one section all, all the way there. There's no need to be for this titanium again. After this short section. What have I been thinking again? Those two are sold bones. Th this whole thing can be just sold, I guess. Oh, I was thinking if one of the, of the train is much faster than the other one, because that was kind of the possibility. Yeah, at, at the start, I didn't think I'm gonna do a separate check for the super fast. But otherwise, if the train in similar in uh, in performance, it will never be able to overtake. Like even let's say this line is the slow one going, and behind him is the fast one, and it's gonna be going this tr track then, and we'll never overtake it and come in here, and then you know a lot of the fastest faster train to overtake, not on that short. Uh, Track. It has to be much much longer for them to be able to, you know, the other one catch it anyway. So short sections actually never have any any merit. Why would you do short, short section like this? Only if you get three trains. If you get three trains on the same track, it's possible there is one train, the second one, and then the third one has to wait. And then you want like those two to pass as soon as possible for the light so the third one can move as so soon as possible. But uh, and it doesn't have to wait, let's say, for this kind of section. There's two trains blocking both tracks, but that's the only only way I can see it. Why you make it short when uh, you cannot try to keep uh, I don't know four trains in tow behind each other, and uh, with those sh short sections you can kind of guarantee this track is full, this track is full, but there is uh, two more trains like uh, maybe here. Those already passed this section, so those two can now move towards here, etc. Et uh, it won't be ever that busy. Uh, this is again not good design on my part when I was doing it. Why did I do it? I think I was trying to save money, I'm not sure. But let's go for this, it's all solved. We'll control the lights really because this is not very well. Yeah, so it's gonna be yeah, in here for the slow one. And then we got this longer section. Oh, okay, now it's now it's uh, yeah, out of alignment because it was ah, oh, goddammit. Well, left side is the one I want to keep. The way it was. Maybe that can be still fixed. Oh my god, if I delete this, it's all the whole thing. God damn it. That's two millions there. Oh. I can go only from there, yeah, that is not gonna be possible. Uh, here's so we get trouble. Even this is not possible. Okay, all I want to do is copy this truck. No, that's in my way, yeah. That's in my way. But there was more than one problem. There is also this. All of this says it's turning collision. It won't be possible regardless. Maybe, maybe I had an issue like that. God damn it. No, this is too many, too much. Like, if I delete this. Yeah, that's like two minutes gone. But if I delete from the tunnel, and then, yeah, we can just wait. 
Ja, Radar, Video, all of this. Then uh, trying to delete this. We may need to even adjust those at different angle. In those two sections, there will have to be the top. Those are the lights. Uh, okay, well, I'll try to keep these sections there. Let's see if we can make it like this. So this is the main one, uh, main connection. Hopefully now the train is not a problem. Yes, it is. It's already giving us a headache because of that. Okay. Uh, it's always some kind of problem. It's not so easy really in this game to do any kind of tracks or anything like that. Uh, it's always some kind of small uh, details that's always preventing. I can't even have two tunnels to make it larger. Sometimes it goes, sometimes it doesn't, and you never know if it's gonna work or not. Uh, that's kind of upsetting really. But indeed, it's just minor thing. It's not really that serious. We can always work it out, but it takes time. A lot of patience. Okay, now what do you guys think? Is it gonna be possible to connect it? What is this section here? That's look. Oh my god! How that even happened? Okay, so at least we know we can drag it somewhere. Then even if I have to change the angle again from right to left, I'll do that. This is not possible. Well, it says now it is. The question is, uh, can we drag this one next to it? Uh, it says we can. The only thing is, we want this one to be able to be next to it as well. Like that. Where's is, where is the station? Station's here, so we can actually. Well, I don't mind. If we can copy all of that, no, we don't have to copy it yet. We can go all around in here. Wait, a moment ago it was still fine. And suddenly it's not. Okay, I'll, I'll connect it like this. It's only 300,000. Let's see if... Yeah, it's fine. It's one of these things. Unexplainable. Yeah, I don't want to slow down on there. I just want straight, regardless. Uh, I, I want, you know, I want to have the track next to each other as long as I can, but then I don't want to sacrifice the speed. I mean, that's why we're doing the bypass in the first place, so it allows for faster speeds. Uh, I don't want to mirror now those two if uh, that's gonna mean it's gonna, yeah, slow down on there. Uh, it still says... Oh no, it's going, yeah. 210 and then 310. Uh, if I can uh, keep the speed, I'll have to do something like this. And then... Yeah, we can, we can do that. Okay, that's fine. And this will be the same problem, I guess. Uh, I don't think we can connect it, but let's have a look. No. Let's see, maybe if I, from here, for some reason may say, no, maybe if I extend by a little bit, and then I'm gonna do that, no, extend it more. Stops too high. Uh, again, maybe I'm going the wrong way, maybe I should try it from here. This is possible, so maybe we do like that. And then I'll just delete this section until we'll find that it's not gonna be pretty, but you know, ain't gonna be pretty, but it may work. <laughs> well, what do we then do? 
to make it somewhat nice because I want to have a little section I want to have together and then obviously I don't want to lose speed I'll do this then as soon as I can again connect it and then I'll have to do th this kind of thing to make it happen but it's gonna work uh, so light in here yes one way I'm gonna wait there I in case there's already train uh, we don't have to worry about if we can go to this section, that's the separate one. And I do think I already... Oh god, where it started? Did I put light in here? No, I didn't. Whether the train can go there or not. I think I should do any of those. Um, I already completely forgot about it. So yes, uh, salt, 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 north, north. Well, we got only one more bypass to do. And then we can definitely separate those trucks. Into fast and slow, and we can put the Shinkansen on there and test it out. How it's gonna feel. I uh, feel it's gonna be feel great. This is all 300 km an hour. Possible all the way, probably to here. And then we'll have to find a way out to. This should be possible to separate in here. We have to go and skip this one. And then connect to Pittsburgh. It will be south actually the outside. Hmm. Well, let's let's see if we can do that. And how much is gonna cost? I mean we get 25 million, I'm pretty sure we can we can finish it. Uh, the only question is how oh, well. Oops. Let's uh, separate. Up to 100 is probably a good start. And then kind of next to it at the maximum possible speed. 300. If I don't have to delete the road, I will not. So this is good enough, I guess. There's no collisions. The icon seems to be too steep because we need to go on that side. Uh, probably, I we'll have to do somewhere there. Oh, this seems to be a good solution. Fastest one. How much? A million. We can try that. And then we bypass in this. We bypass in this below the city. Hopefully, can do it. This could be another problem. will be even larger loop but you know because of the top speed and not stopping down it will be definitely faster regardless but this is gonna be a problem we can cancel the road I mean this is also going nowhere but I would rather not if I don't have to Probably trying impossible, really. Uh, let's one more to pass first, so let's worry about this. Now let's worry about anything else. Okay, this seems to be okay, so let's do that. Yeah, we'll have to go straight and then. No, we need to get slow again. It must be allowing for a good loop, but. Uh, not a million, hopefully it's not wasted a million. Ah, 299 is good speed. And this seems to be working, so I may as well just go for it. Uh, angle's good, as I'm a million though. And a couple tunnels later. I need to go across. Oh, I was, a, I was already... It was already allowing me to pass. Like this. This is to be good. Uh, fastest one. Yeah. Now we can probably connect it. Yeah. To oh yeah. What is that? Entrance. 
Uh, it's not connected here on the outside. So I'm gonna do another million something. Maximum speed everywhere, isn't it? Yeah. And then this loop's gonna be connecting on here. At some decent speed still. We can do it yeah on this one actually. Oh, we're gonna get one more in here, I don't know. This is already hard enough, uh, maybe I should yield. And this is good connection to place it. And you can certainly shorten those up if you need to. This is the speed on this one, 179. This is the speed on this one, 178. Honestly, it doesn't matter that much. I kind of want to do this still. You definitely have to show them up. You can see where to start, but it's split in here. There's no way we're gonna allow us to do the third one there. The same is for this though, but this is too long. So perhaps. This is still 178 anyway. Yeah, I'll, I guess I'll just gonna keep it like this. Trying to attach this is probably, yeah, not probably, it's definitely not possible. We'll have to shorten those up, let's pause the game. Way too long. Lights went weak team again. Now hopefully I connect all the connections the way it should be. <laughs> Do I even need to split this again? Why did I split that in the first place? This is a decent length, uh, okay, but this section may be yeah, not even necessary. But that means I will have to make connection in here anyway, I don't think that's possible. If I decide to do that. Uh, we'll have to test it out, let's, uh, let's have a look. So let's say I delete all of this. Oh, God, I remember how much troubles I got with this one to build it. That, that was like, I spent a lot of time, it wasn't possible. Hopefully, didn't make a mistake doing this. <sighs> this is the, that line here. Yeah. No. Of the shortest possible distance. And now it won't, it won't let me. Yeah, I, I fucked up. I had the same problem last time, I just remembered. It simply would not let me. Uh, but there is no unbutton, un undoing button. Control Z, nope. Nope. <laughs> just, uh. God damn it. I fucked up. This connection is that one. I mean, not much. Okay, well, it looks like the whole thing will have to be good. It will not simply work. It's just basic guidance. Uh, cancel those lights. Let's cancel those lights too. See if we can make this work in the first place. So the main connection. No, it's not like now. Oh, that doesn't know what we need to connect though. Okay. This ain't gonna be fun. All fucked up now, I guess. All of them. But let's not delete any more for the moment. I'll just try to make it work regardless. Okay, so that should be now kind of equalized, like that's fine. We'll need to 
fix the terrain, I guess. Otherwise, just based on that again, there'll be a couple issues. Now, what will happen? If I simply tried to take this, and connect it to the appropriate one, which is this one. Okay, that's, uh, yeah, that's not a good idea, so we'll have to make it like this. Like that. And that must be connected to... that's the node. Okay, now let, let's imagine we separate the trucks into two. But we want to do it much closer to the station, so the train doesn't have to wait uh, for the train with the station there too, too long. Over here. No. Curse too high. See, this is what I spent last time so much time because you wouldn't really let me. And then I kind of get it looking okay ish. Trouble. Oh, that's good enough. That's good enough. The train can wait here. Okay, and now this should be possible to connect. Oh my god, okay, north is done. Imagine that. All we need is uh, two lights. I'll do it now. Indicate if they can enter this one or not. Well, that's north. So when they're going out, it's going this way, and the lines finish here. Yeah. And then they want to wait for the next section. Why is this? Why is this? It's also one of the things. Uh, this makes no sense. What, what do you? What do I do? I'm not sure what is it doing exactly. Hopefully it's possible to connect those things. Without too much shovel. Since we're fixing that things, we can fix this as well. Because I see it. I can't ignore it. Yeah, there's a very cool issue on this one. I'll have to fix that. Uh, this one should be connecting. Yeah. Can this one connect? Can. So just this one. And that's fine now. Alright, that looks so much better. What, what I was thinking there really. Good, so that's done. And now I need to finish this out. So this is the main connection. Why is this already in a. Like this, I, I think I'll have to delete this one as well, the whole thing. God damn it. That's quite a large section, but it will, yeah, it will, well, I think it will go. So do that. Okay, so I think, yeah, until. Where is the bench starting? Can't even tell. No, this will, yeah, this will, this will determ determine. Because we have to go from this one. Too much. Well, how do you make it last? Too much. Oh, I see. Well, something tells me you can. No? I mean, surely. How? Why? 
Oh, and white. Why well, is this ball? Don't tell me no, this is not good enough. I want to delete the whole thing again. See, you guys, I, this is where I spent so much time last time. Um, it wasn't so easy. I don't think there's a solution for this. I think literally the game doesn't let me to do that angle I want. I want this angle. Uh, therefore, we'll have to redo this one. seems to be silly because like this seems to be like that should be good enough why is it not good enough what is the problem here huh well it seems to be so long I'm not going to on it like that. Let's probably do the same. Okay, they can be connected in here, I guess. Now, if this can go here, the question is, can this... Oh, that's the wrong one. That's the outside. No, that's, that's not how it's supposed to be connected. Uh, yeah. We all need to connect this to the third one and this to that and this one can still go let's see how close we can get it before connecting but I imagine we'll have to make the connection somewhere here and there we go that's good enough for me as well and again this is the north oh, let's instantly do not So we actually don't know where it's connection yet, so let's not do that. Now we can bring the salt. Okay, actually I don't want it too long because I need to connect the fast one as well. What says here? Now, if that's coming from south, that means the lights must be facing this way. Oh. Hopefully. We will be able to connect it now, because if not, again, I'll have to rebuild the whole stuff. And I should test it now, because all we really need is just to know that this can be... Any place. But it won't, it won't let us. This is why I test it because if I bring the connection again in here and we find out. Okay, even. I can't. But I think there was a possibility to connect this a lot sooner, so let's try to do that. Let's not overextend too much on it. As soon as we can put it, we'll put it. And now it's like going crazy. Uh, okay, as soon as we can in here signal the way. Or was it? Uh, was it been I don't even know which one. It seems to be gone. Oh, come on. I want to light in here to indicate if you can go or not. Okay, and let's see. Can we now? It seems to be a lot more space in there. Uh, can we not start from there? Maybe start from here. 
fucking hell. Oh. I think we got it, boys. And connect, yeah. Oh god, okay. Okay, so let's go. Oops. Let's go from there. Oh, let's connect it to. 240s, don't you know what? Oh, there you go. Bypass done. Only thing that's missing is the light indicating if you can approach the station or not. She must be in here. Oh god, we did it, guys. Uh, there could be some other mistakes on the other sections of the loop, or uh, maybe some shorts. Like this, this could be one section. Oh, yeah, this definitely can be one, one section. There's no need for this kind of thing happening. I'll fix that in maybe in the next episode. Same in here, there's no need for that. Uh, I'll fix it later. But I did all of this just for one reason so we can already put Shinkansen on the fast one and we're gonna put the cheap ones on the salt loop. So Yeah, we need to put salt loop normal. Uh, okay, so salt is going this way, right? And right here. Bye. Multiple. Oh, this is also a multiple. What is this? 180 kilometers an hour, 7,000 power, 470 traction. Well, that's not running cost 1 million. It's not too bad for the years. But this must be uh, like a freight train or something. And we probably have new wagons, yeah, and there's a new one which can go 150, but that's not faster than this one. This one is 201, yeah. But passenger is 33 instead of 21. But again, it won't make sense. This is just for the engine, 1 million. And if you got some passenger trains, uh, carriages will be much more, and it's only 180. But power is insane. It could be good for the uh, freight, but we don't have any freight, so no worries about that. This is obviously the way to go. Bye. Let's put it on soap. So now we got two of those trains in there. Uh, momentarily, let's take this one. Where are you, my friends? It's got ten people. I don't even know where, where it is. Oh, it's going to Pittsburgh. Now it's got 21. 20, 12, 29. But it's going to Pittsburgh. I think it's going to be unloaded regardless. Uh, we can already try to squeeze it on the salt fast oh I didn't indicate by the waypoints yet that you're supposed to use these ones okay we can put it salt fast that's that's absolutely fine still get people there right but now it's a line salt fast Five. Where is five? Which one is five? One, two. One, two what? what? Five. Yeah, so it's, it's not taking the super fast. So after five, sorry, after four, yeah, five. After five, you need to make waypoint. Uh, waypoint. Here. Uh, at station, after five, you need to go. There you go. That's gonna use the bypass. All the way to here. Well, that's seven, and after seven, new waypoint. Waypoint. After seven, waypoint. This one. There you go. New bypass. To station this one. Yeah. And after nine, also new waypoint.
There we go. And now we get separated the fast one from the slow one. All we need is our. Uh, how can Nord loop? Oh, we're milling because of the Shinkansen. Well, we did, did that uh, minus. Oh, doesn't matter. Okay, so. Us approaching the Pittsburgh, yeah. Tell us. So we're gonna see. We can watch it for one full round on the fast one. And I guess we're gonna end the episode as soon as we finish the loop. Uh, perhaps we're gonna see some new engines we can check very quickly at the end. Uh, we're gonna find out. Yeah, approaching here very, very slow. You know, all this tightening up, but now I assume, yeah, we're gonna be actually flying. Uh, the first sections we didn't fix yet, like there'll be some tight spaces squeezing in us uh, for no reason really, but even this I can fix. It doesn't have to be like this. Oh, it had to because I was trying to compete, yeah. Oh, it's just start. Uh, it should go on the left, isn't it? That was on the fast one design, yeah, of course. Can't do that, but it's still accelerating, it's not that bad. It's fully yeah, forcing that 62 on there, it can go any faster. When every carriage passed that, it's gonna start spinning up. It's spinning up now as well. It's 14 people doing them so fast. That's impressive, the, the line didn't exist uh, moments ago. People already. Yeah, that's full, look at that. Make it because we're gonna have to go and uh, check the economics and uh, what we can improve in there, how to, how to get more money out of that. Okay. Already on the phone. Already on the phone as well. In our. I think that's something crazy. It's a madness. Yeah, now it's falling down because of the, the section here. Yeah. That we have. Uh, there's a band in there. Finding out that the soul chain will be able to go in straight line so it doesn't have to slow down. In the slow move. There's no other better way how to do that because there must be some kind of access to the depot. Uh, maybe we can do waypoint for this one for the for the fast one and switch it around. I mean that's one solution we can do. So we force the slow be on the outside and the fast one on the inside. See, so it doesn't have to slow down. And then we can go on the outside again. Yeah. This one has its own chuck so it doesn't actually get squeezed. But this can be also just this there's no need for this. You can always extend all of this into one perfect line. Now we need to squeeze it into the actual station. And that was a very slow section really for this train. I only get better though. Anybody coming out or in? Some people out. I didn't see anybody coming in. And this seems to be very peculiar as well. Copying the shape in here so it's fully bleeding and some speed in here. Considering we still just only in the phase of activation, but there is also then on here it may slow down how fast we can go. It's still accelerating now. I can't tell, I can't, oh, this will be the better, I'm sure. But at least we are able to speed up, we don't have to actually wait. Same speed. Alright, it's quite bad, uh, uh, it's one of these things, I shouldn't be copying this. We'll fix you later, so all that will be just straight line. Yes, this one is straight line too. We'll be separated into the hill so we can fight off the next station. The train is still accelerating. 154. Uh, 
work horses now. All in mind cows. Okay, 184. 90. Again, the limit on this train is 209. 198 was in there before we got the slow down. And it's only because we are approaching the station. All those tight spots squeezing this, not necessary, I'll just extend it for much longer sections. Too many of them, no reason. Oh, I need to get to the station somehow, so yeah. Lots of time bends, that's why we need to slow down all the way to 48. Now there'll be the new section which we couldn't use before. And I wonder if it's gonna be that fast or not, because as you see, it's gonna be quite a steep climb, but then we got like this will be able to go up to 300. And we're gonna be completely bypassing. The next station. Okay, is anybody waiting for us fast one? No, some people unloaded, two still left. No one loaded. How far is this going to be these new sections of the chart? So again, the other train on the slow one, uh, because it got a good acceleration, it's probably going to be doing already 100, we do it 81, and the climb it first. So, it's uh, really questionable if the difference in performance is not that high when you're doing all this extra climbing on all this extra travel distance although we don't have to stop at the next station but it still doesn't really matter as much uh, in the end I guess we're gonna find out uh, the final times and compare the times uh, if it's gonna be in the end faster or not and, uh, it should be faster but uh, how much is it even worth I think it's like 15 minutes or something like that. I split the customers in two sections. It's really just more for uh, fun than anything else. It's not a good, good business decision, let's put it this way. And it's something we want to do. Let's put it in nice, something like that. Okay, 170. I do hope maybe before it wasn't possible to hit 210, we only hit 209. Now there are new sections of the truck now and take quite long, allowing for the maximum speed as well of 300, so it's losing speed now momentarily. 197, 198, 197 again, and then up 200. Okay, let's see. Can we hit 210? We can skip the next station, maybe it was already skipped, hard to tell. Bypassed completely as possible. 204. 205. This is where we already, to be honest, this was a session that uh, in 1509. No more charts. 206 now. 207. Wait. Oh no, this is the one we're gonna be skipping. And this is the section then. Yeah, we're skipping this one, this is the section with 209. It's still not now, too. And it's quite serious climb now. And if we can see if it's gonna lose some power. Or not. To wait, it doesn't lose power. Wait, yeah, this, this section was 209 before the whole way. But you know what? Because we're going to be climbing much higher, I guess, uh, we may as well have a long, steeper downhill. And that may hit 
see on 10 then the 209 now can we make it can we make a new speed record no no we have to slow down two of one as well is the maximum i'm pretty sure all this section right there was too nice still was too much incline uh, up and down for this train to be able to and then see the massive bend I don't know it'll be that, that fast here. Yeah. I'm pretty sure all this section was 209. Those outside loops that will be considered to be the short ones will be the long sections. You have to switch the tracks from, uh, rename it like uh, the short one is the fast one. And the long one also is a bypass, but it's not the bypasses to the stations there. Oh, it doesn't matter, does it? No, it does, because you can't use those short ones for uh, all, the, all the stations. Huh. I have tricked myself thinking this is working, it's not gonna work either way. Yeah, just a waste of time, I guess. Oh, there's somebody in here, this is going to be more straight, perhaps this section is going to be faster than the other one, and we're going to skip all the stations, but yeah, it's, it's pretty, we'll see, we'll, we'll see, when we look at the times after we do the full lap, what it's going to tell us, so we look, oh, we're back to making profit, after spending the money on the track, etc. Speed still. I really hope it's gonna go faster, but it looks like it's climbing still on 80 now. Yeah, it's questionable if any, any of these can be actually making it even faster. Although it's bypassing the terrain, it's uh, go more uphill, it's uh, more, yeah, it's longer, but it's not because it's kind of legal loops. It may not even be faster in the end. At all. All it is is a separate track so it doesn't mix with the stations. You know, be stopped by the other trains if they stop on the stations because we can pass by. This year will not stop on the drive up here. I'm worried about train being in our way or something like that, nothing else. So from that point of view it may, but otherwise, yeah. Even at 208, 209, I will do 210. We go up and assume so, most likely not. Even here, the color is going to reduce it. 209 is pretty decent. What is this? That's not connected. I have to go fix that. Let me pass the game. What was that? Oh, that's a... What is that? Oh, is that two more? Okay. I, I thought it's just... It didn't look like uh, it's connected. But it must be two more. To here, yeah, I, I do remember now. Yeah, that's the one. Because far away still to Pittsburgh, yeah. Cool. So no, this, this was the section with 209 speeds. The one before that was something else. Was this one. Or maybe there was 209 too. 
No, but I think no, it was different. This one was the two nine before. The one before it wasn't possible. Okay, so we are somewhere else than I thought. I thought we are way ahead. So we are over blue. Bent. Almost feels like we're gonna have to go to slow down up to complete stuff. Well, it's actually still 49 kilometers an hour, which is faster than uh, the early trains was doing at the top speed. Some people waiting. And this is the dedicated track for the so fast. The next to us is this. Actually, we know that this is for the Balti and they might uh, ignore me. This could be all just normal salt, but no, okay, uh, pretty much every single one of them took this salt fast. We're probably taking customers away from this salt. That doesn't mean we're gonna stop the service on the salt. We will maintain that as well. Over time, we'll attract more people. This is actually, we're actually gonna increase probably. Again, since we can really afford it now, making quite good money from the Pittsburgh to West Jordan. We can operate uh, six trains on both of the loops, uh, in which will not make money. At least some of them will, most of them will not make money. This is one of the massive bypasses now as well. It's actually going down home, but now we climb it more steeply. And there we go, there's some cars traveling between cities via some roads. You see, guys, you are nowhere near. The train. I'm going to now. I should take the train instead. I'm going to embarrass you by flying fast. I'm going to now. Downhill now, and there is a turn build, and we're breaking now. Well, not your record, uh, but all in all, I'm kind of happy with the new bypasses. It's not too bad, it's definitely better than the early ones. Comparison to the other train, and the salt, uh, normal one, that's gonna be any faster or not because those trains are really very close to impairments to each other. 
But uh, the normal cell is much shorter. Oh, look at that. That's probably from uh, Jamestown there. Oh, yeah, where's Jordan? Jamestown. I don't know why I always call Jamestown, but where's Jordan? Or that actually could be normal salt. That is normal salt. You know what, guys? Let's, let's watch it if we're gonna overtake it or not. Because it won't be any better than, than, than this ever. Uh, literally, that changes life. That's why we can now. We have to stabilize now, we can move. And we're gonna see if those bypass work and we're gonna actually overtake it and that's gonna put any doubt at rest if we're gonna overtake it that means we are faster and then we make around the full loop in shorter time and after one full loop we can look at the finances as well no we pretty much operating last year it was maximum out of 144 we pay 136 so yeah it didn't make much money Oh, the other chain is really fast. Yeah, head start, sort of pretty much gone. That's what I want to see. That's the last thing I want to see, but now you've already seen it in uh, real time. So we don't need to do that. All I'm going to do is to find out when you get closer if you're going to overtake it or not. We're going to get it. Uh, find it. This way, though. So there's the slowdown again. The other chain didn't have to slow down. That's something I want me to fix later. We're going to switch the trucks. Fast and slow. And in here, we will still have to do a similar money, have to wait for him, but the train's already gone. You can't even see it in front of us. In all it's gone, it's really fast. And this is what we do it. Uh, okay, we, we basically start, we start right behind him, other people. And there was no other way how to do that. We literally have to stop at the, at the lights because we don't get the chance yet. So, that's pretty much the scenario which we're going to find out. Okay, so if he's going to block us at some other station, let's say he's going to just run away. Can we overtake him using the bypass? If not in this station anymore, which you have to stop, is he over here? Now, it doesn't look like we're going to catch him. He's going to block us in this one as well. So this section didn't allow us to overtake him. It's not faster than what he can do. He's going to block us in this device as well. And here again, he can go just straight. It's going to be much faster than that. Us crawling down here. Uh, it's probably not faster at all. If anything, we'll have to switch this one for the slow one, that will be the fast one. We'll speed things up. But we can't do that because this one is actually overtake, you know, it's not going to the station, to every station. That will be the slow one. Chains are simply too much close in performance. The other one will have to be much slower. Again, uh, it does have to stop on the next station, we don't have to stop on the next station, but I don't think that would be enough. It's still in front of us. I think there's a station here, you have to pass that. So I have to pass that, and I would go into the tunnel. He is in the phone, so he's even faster than us. He's gonna be at the next station, which we also have to stop. Uh, sooner than us, he's gonna block us again, I guess, at the lights. There we go, the left. We may even already left, it's that much. Oh no! We just overtook him. Okay, on this section we overtook him. <laughs> Barely. But we did. Now, it doesn't mean we will not catch up <laughs> to us and overtake us on this shorter loop on the way to Pittsburgh. I guess we're going to find them now. But, uh, places have been reversed. Let's put this one on screen as well. Well, this one watch as well is that uh, average speed and acceleration. They also got some people, yeah, there was people not split between the two lines, so it's one of the trains making money, but this one is really... What the fuck? He, he made 1.68 million. Look at it, the, the soldier is uh, profitable as fuck, he's doing it, all of this. It's largely only, actually we didn't lose much, half a million is, is amazing. That's amazing. 
Yeah, but that one's still on the station. We are way, way, way past that now. So I guess he, he's run out, out of luck. There's no way he's gonna catch us now. Uh, we still overtaken the next, next station completely. And he walked to the next one. I mean, no. So we did manage to overtake him in, in the end. And that's gonna allow us to really create quite a distance, really. And then at some point, uh, we're gonna catch him again from behind. Uh, at one of the stations, and uh, we know which se section we can overtake him for sure. It cannot happen between uh, Pittsburgh and uh, the next extensions there. But we're gonna fix that section anyway, that's, that's all wrong. So maybe it can happen there as well. Uh, but we, we know exactly now which section it is possible to overtake the other, other train. Only barely, but it did happen there. I'm surprised I didn't to change the result from the station, most likely. Uh, then it was like, you can't even see in the distance, uh, it can be it's behind me and it was actually just going through the tunnel. Just at our ass. Frankly, I almost wish I had normal speed on there. So I treated more better. But I'm happy that no, it wasn't for nothing. All, all of this actually works. Uh, barely, but it does. Now there's no doubt, we have a massive advantage. I cannot Pass the game when we are in Pittsburgh and I'm gonna check where is the other train and we'll see how much distance between them. And uh, we will shorten the time as well, shorten the time so we can lose. After two rounds of this, we are always on You see, I didn't even notice now it's only normal speed. It's going so fast. <laughs> like, I should almost put in normal speed now to. Uh, no, let's, let's speed that again, I'll just want to the time for sure. I really thought it would speed up the no, it's fine now, but it's just even an hour, no more. Put that put back in time. Crazy speed. It doubles in real time. Okay, so this is kind of oh yeah, we need to stop on this one. I guess it's much smoother for the other train actually on this one. It's nice and straight. You can keep the speed much longer, but there's no way, this double chain is nowhere inside. It's definitely far behind us. Next thing you know, it's gonna be coming from the corner. <laughs> See? We're still ahead of it, uh, that's for sure. That's supposed to be that was a troll at Donald Trump's here. Let's see how many of these people are gonna be waiting for this fast track or not. And quite a number. Uh, not only has something going just with the normal one. Oh, the other train is going already at maximum speed, 180. So, so wait. But again, this is a bypass on the next station. There will be a station there. Yeah, there's one more station. The moment it's we're just going to go straight. It's speeding up. Technically, it's still catching up on us. It's still 180. How long is on the maximum speed? It's pretty much always showing at maximum speed. You can really accelerate very quickly there. But now it's slowing down because of the station, the last one we beat. In the meantime, we're speeding up massively, and we probably already yeah, passed the next station after that. So we really created a serious distance between ourselves. Now we're showing 206, 207, there's no way that can catch us anyway. We only 180. There we go, we are already on Pizza. Pretty much. That's amazing. I'm so happy it worked because I already thought at some point maybe it's uh, not even worth it. And uh, since it is a bypass, it's bypass on the stations, you can't even use it in the reverse. You don't want to have the slow, the fast, you know, train going on uh, every single station. It will make no sense if slow one doing every second one. It's always going to make like the fastest one is the one that also skip the station, so it's much much faster. But it means the tracks he's using should be faster as well in time, and this this one is they did allow for that overtaking to happen. Lovely. Now he's uh, probably on the station. The last station before Pittsburgh, just arriving, and we are already at, at Pittsburgh, so that's quite a distance there. Uh, we'll see it in, in a moment. 
You still there? Yeah, let's pause the game. Yeah, he's right here. So the, the distance we gained so far is all of this. Uh, he will have to slow down as well. So it, it, it's quite, it, it's quite a feat, you know, to really build a distance. Uh, let's have a look at the loops, official numbers. Uh, so the official sold loop is 23 minutes, and this one is by four minutes shorter at 19. So that's very decent, very very decent. Uh, north loop is 22, so north loop is faster than south loop. It's exactly the same chain, so from the other side it should be faster than 19 minutes. Uh, should we do it properly? Well, what year is it now? 1986, that was almost 10 years. That's pretty much it then, I guess, yeah. We're gonna leave the rest for the next episode then, and I'll see you guys in the next one.